Guys, if you're watching this, make sure you subscribe. If you want to watch the whole thing, you can watch it on YouTube, Apple Podcasts or Spotify. Welcome back to another episode of Saving Grace. Today we've only got Sophie and Jamie. Clap, clap, clap. Oh click, yeah, click, or click, click, click. click. Do, click. Can I just ask a question? Here we go. <clears throat> Do, if you were going to say, um, yeah. would you would start with Sophie? You'd say Sophie and Jamie. You wouldn't say Jamie and Sophie. Well, um, ja- no, actually I would, if I was, yeah, well, I'd probably say grace. Jamie and Sophie. No, because you I said? did it last time. I thought, fuck, I've got to switch things up a bit. What do you mean? We'll I think a, this is my first Sophie time on and it. Jamie, Jamie and so- Sophie and Jamie. Sophie and Jamie rolls off the tongue. Usually, though, I don't know why. Maybe this is the inner, like, mm. sexism in me. But sometimes I do put the man first. I wouldn't. I'd say Grace and... So I'm going to switch that Grace shit and up. <laughs> Grace and quarter zip. Yeah. Who knows? Grace and Jeremy. Try, try, <laughs> do you, try and guess Grace's boyfriend's name. Here we go. Do you have a boyfriend? I do. I know that is a shot. Scott. Scott. There's a lot to unpack there. <laughs> no. You've got um, one more guess. Go, go, um, it's more like foreign. Where, where does he live? It's foreign. Where does he live? Just, I need a what? clue. Where? Like Croydon. Croydon, all from, right, all right. From Jake, Norway. Jake. He's originally from Norway. Jake. No, what the fuck? When was Billy a Norwegian name? <laughs> Billy. Billy. Yeah, so no, that's not. Is that short for William? <laughs> no, but everyone says this. His mum did just call him Billy. And fair play to her. <laughs> I, just, just, I just wanted you to guess a Norwegian name. Uh, <laughs> I don't know what I'd say, like Frank. I would say Francois. Francois. That's more educated on that than I would say um, Heidi. (laughs) But (laughs) in that way. Hayden? I don't know. Hayden. Hayden. Anyway, uh, (laughs) we're going to dive straight into it. You both made in Chelsea, right? Mm. Back in the back in the days, Ax, yeah. You were there first. Mm -hmm. I just want to know how you how you started on there. Does someone just go? Do you want to be posh on TV or what was the I think it outreach? did start like that. I think it started like that because they were basically like, so at the beginning it was something called like Chelsea Girls. So they were like, okay, oh, we're going to shoot sexist. something called, yeah, Chelsea Girls. Oh, sorry, was it? That was the original thing. <laughs> I think good. I watched from the beginning, major fan over there. <laughs> yeah, but it was. It but, does help. Yeah, it does help. But before it was named Chelsea, it was Chelsea Girls. That was the, that, that's before it was even put on TV. Fine. Oh. And then they changed the name to Made in Chelsea. Oh, and that name. Oh, well, mate, you don't like Made in Chelsea? Do you think it's a good name? I think it is. It's like eye catching, even that's a name. Mm. I wonder who was actually Made in Chelsea. Me? Who? No, you aren't. Yeah, I was you what? Made in Gloucestershire. I was made in the John Radcliffe in, in Oxford, and then I was then made in Chelsea because when I moved to London, I lived in Kensington, like the people from Parent Trap. Wow. Yeah. Wow. Anyway, stunning. What, yeah. What happened was. <laughs> stunning. Yeah, stunning. What happened was is that the name created the show, and they were like, <laughs> they were like, you're posh. <laughs> you should come on this TV show. And I was like, really? Okay, great. I'll come yeah. do it. And um, that's kind of happened. But we did it. I did it for like a long time. That's kind of happened. Yeah, that's so kind of happened. How did they recruit? I suppose that I'd walk around like Chelsea and see who has the accent and go, ever heard of this? Mm. Would you like to do that maybe? Mm. And I think maybe they do that. I think that's kind of what happened. Yeah. I think they walked around and they were like, okay, I feel like you're... No, posh. surely you were friends with the people who were already on it. But I was, but that was even before it started. Rich uh, people and connections, you know, that's mm. incredible. They were like, you look rich. Yeah. <laughs> you should. <laughs> yeah. Wait, even better that, your parents look rich. <laughs> Do you want to Therefore. Was it the same for you then? They just were like, fuck I it, got, come on. I got a little Facebook message. Oh, that is rogue. Yeah, I did. Christ. Did Facebook message now and again, and I was like, surely this is a fake thing. And then, yeah. Then I went on it. Did you, did you, who did you fancy before coming on? Why do you always ask me this Because I want to know the truth. I wish I remembered. I feel oh, like bastards. it was Andy Jordan. Do you know it was dark times about them? <laughs> the truth was dark times about them. <laughs> You've grown. You know, I've grown. You're a better person now. I've, I've grown. grown. If I could take my mind back to it and remember. I'd cast your mind back. I but it was can't. so juicy back in the day. Like Mate, the day of like so Lucy good. Watson and she did not give a fuck. <laughs> she didn't care. She did not care at all. It was so juicy. Mm. I fucking loved it. Yeah, it was great. And also there was like no filter because I think what happened back in the day is we didn't actually think we were being filmed. And then we would watch it back and Didn't be like, think "It would go out." Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. I like, quite literally never knew I was being filmed, even until the day I left. I really? used to like storm off crying, what? and they'd be following me in with the camera, and I'd be like, "Well, they're obviously not filming me with like my tampon next to me." You knew exactly what <laughs> you were doing. Were. Jamie walked out and was like, "Great TV." Oh. I was like, "Hey, 
cheated on me. You, are you seriously saying that you didn't know what was going on the I whole time? I thought whatever happened, I'd just go to them because I was quite close with them all. Yeah, yeah. So I thought. Cut so I'd be that like, out. I was like, please don't do that. Like, don't make me look bad. They were like, all right. Don't worry. I'd watch it back next week. Like, yeah. There I am, like, snotting out my nose. But that's a common theme, crying on reality TV. Oh, my what, God. Just nothing. crying with me. And just, just, <laughs> I think I did three years of just crying. That's all people saw. Did Tears. you have any, like, pre... What's the word? Preconceptions? Is that the word? No, of, I was like, so naive. My dad oh, really? was like, he had to turn it off because I was so... Because <laughs> <laughs> you were so awful. I, I don't think... I, I also I, had these, like... Ah! So, I had these eyelash extensions but lovely yeah you know i would get them now i'm allergic so oh. i found out but i went full force russian eyelashes they were right. i mean they thick. were thick they were thick Fair. and my yeah. dad's like whoa what he kept trying to say What's wrong with your eyes <laughs> and then one day i got an allergic reaction to them and they still made me film they were like don't worry Not yeah you but with so, like puffy eyes yeah but so we had an allergic reaction to it and then we then we so we had another allergic uh, this is a strange thing about you should get some hand, antihistamine do you know what I mean? Pop it every day. Yeah, yeah. I'm allergic to everything. Like dust in my eye right now. But Sophie does, <laughs> Sophie, Sophie does it. We went on a trip to Mexico, our first like trip together. Right. And, and Sophie then the night before said, oh, I'm going to get my eyelashes done. I was like, okay, cool, whatever, fine. She got the same eyelashes that give her a reaction. I normally reactions. get them tinted. But yeah. I was like, it's been a year. Mm. Obviously, I'm not allergic. I'm quite hardcore. You're immune now. Yeah, we, immune. we took off and, and I'm not even kidding you. Uh, we um, burning. We were, <laughs> we were burning alive. We were in. We were in. Um, we were in business class. Yeah. All right, Legend. Yeah. What well, I was. No need for that. <laughs> yeah. Just painting the scene. Yeah yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Look, just get the scene. We're in business. Class. No, because sat I, behind each other because you didn't book chat seats oh, together. So I was like, that's what I was going to say because I didn't want it to sound like I wasn't sitting next to you. And then I, and I suddenly get the tap on the shoulder and I look around. Honestly, it was like Cosimodo. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that's two so hours sad. in, ten hours to go. <laughs> and she was like, is it bad? <laughs> you were like, no. <laughs> so I then Google, you know how you have to get on like the Wi-Fi and you have to pay yeah. for Again, it? Again, so relatable. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you do have to get on the Wi-Fi. Take on... out a mortgage to get an hour of Wi-Fi <laughs> on the plane. Yeah. 12 quid yeah. half an hour. <laughs> yeah. I had I had to get the Wi-Fi and I was like, ah. And I was like, what happens if this happens? And the first thing that came up was, you'll go blind. <laughs> Like, you did not tell. I no. Had, yeah, I was going to say, I'm like, emergency land now. I, I go, just opened the I door on the flight. The, um, <laughs> firstly, just to set the scene, we'd already been told off by this, the, what's he called? A steward? Yeah, steward. Uh, uh, because oh. we were canoodling. I was like, sorry, I gave him a oh, kiss. Jesus Christ. I'm, so, I'm quite a prude over here. Yeah. And then I had to go up to him and be like, do you have any oil? Because it said the only way to do oh. it was, so I was going like this with olive oil, mini olive oil, 16 on That's me. a low point. Yeah, yeah. I would 100% say. I, I landed with oil all over me, no eyelashes. Kind of like you had like a happy ending on the plane. <laughs> it was awful. Speak, speak your witch. That is, a, I had, I, I, have you ever had, have you ever, have you ever joined the Marlai Club? I fly easy mm. jet. There's no room. You've never done it? There's no. honestly no room. I've never done it either. Are you sure? Why are you saying that? Oh, I just, I just could. See me. I'm suddenly really angry. <laughs> No. Which is real alcohol. What, that, I, the, the, what, that I've had, so I haven't had sex on a flight. Well, why are you thinking so sketchy then? I, I don't know. I, I would never be in the mood. I'm all, I'm all. You're a bit dirty on a flight. Diazepam up. Do you know yeah. what I mean? Getting on the plane. <laughs> mm. Although once we had this uh, private jet thing for, for like a brand. Oh, hello. And oh, no. I was like, if I wanted to, I could. But it's a bit bumpy, isn't it, on planes? I think mm. that could cause an injury somewhere. Yeah. I had a friend at school called Milo who... Is that your story about the mom? Well, I'm about to say, I had a friend at school called Milo who honestly came back to school and he, like, kicked open our, like, common room door. <laughs> screw it, he, like, it was some sort of West. And he went, boys, you'll never guess what I did. <laughs> <laughs> and we're like, what, Milo? And he was like, ah, sitting on the flight between my, my brother and my sister, had a wank. <laughs> Fuck off. And, and he thought he had joined the Mile High Club because he had a oh, wank. No. His sister definitely Milo, clocked as well. It? I'm sorry. It's, I'd be like, I've got to call social services. <laughs> yeah, That's yeah. mental. Just hold it. Did, did anyone? Oh, <laughs> oh no. No, 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 no. I had another friend called Adam who said... That's Why are you naming Shady? Yeah. Bloody hell. Yeah. Sorry, Adam. I had another friend called Adam. Say his surname. I'm not going to say his surname. I had another friend called Adam said, it's not as bad as me. <laughs> My grandparents were driving me back no. to school and he, had, and he said, oh, can I get into the boot because he wanted to he said I want to get in the boot so I can pretend like I'm a dog and he got into the boot and had a wank <laughs> it'd be nice to be a boy sometimes I do think his that. parents didn't give no grandparents didn't give a fuck about him imagine putting a child in a boot <laughs> yeah, imagine God. if they got pulled over for speeding and he's just in the back there having a fucking wank <laughs> 
broken now. They'd be like, like, what on earth has happened in this vehicle? <laughs> don't stop, don't stop, don't yeah. stop. <laughs> yeah, but nearly that. So I would, I, I got stopped when I was oh, naked. I would, hold on to, I would hold on to the boot. <laughs> they were trying to open no, it up. No, please stop oh, no the images. <laughs> No one's in there. No one's in Let here. Me out. No one's in here. No one's in How the fuck did we get onto wanking in a boot? I don't even remember the original question. Uh, wanking. Is all that? Wanking in court, wanking in a boot. Well, I'm not getting any ads on this one, am I? <laughs> I'm not getting ad revenue on this pod, so... Thanks for that. Just getting caught wanking in a, a boot. Hard month for me. Getting caught wanking in a boot would be the lowest. <laughs> yeah. The, do you think, yeah, I reckon... What's the weirdest place you've had a wank? Uh, I know Lou. A <laughs> toilet. Why have you done that then? Well, well yeah. I remember once I sat on your knee and you went and had a wank when we were mates. I, to me, that's like my golden hour. I'm like, oh, just me sitting on his knee. Just oh, made him rise. Oh my God. That is mental. But, but I think guys, I think what happens, if you're, if you're quite sexually driven, I oh, think... Oh God, I think we need you. Sexually driven? Well, I don't know. What I, an earth kind of phrase is that? What, when you're you, horny. What on earth is sexually driven about? I don't know. <laughs> what kind of phrase? When you're sexually driven. <laughs> <laughs> when you have a high sex drive <laughs> actually quite creepy <laughs> yeah it it's, is it's like on the Hinge a, profile it's like going driven. to a sex party and being like are you sexually driven oh do you know what I could see you guys doing like shut um, up Grace no I could I could see you guys what's it called like a swingers S thing no killing kittens okay, <laughs> okay. I, I could not do are you joking I'm the most no I think oh really no I'm not am I <laughs> Let's change the conversation. Do you think you would be good at a sex party? Are you fucking joking? No, I'd be like, don't touch me. Ew, what's that? I'd be a bit self-conscious. I'd be like, can I keep my top on? I'd be like, can I keep my right? on? Uh, yeah, I'd see all the other women and be like, actually, maybe I'll take it off. <laughs> <laughs> you think you'd keep your top <laughs> yeah. on? Yeah, I think, and I'd ask to turn the lights off too. Obviously. I'd just sit there on all fours waiting for something to slip in. <laughs> What is he? <laughs> like some sort of like some sort of goat. I mean, like, <laughs> don't make it beastly. Oh, like that's that you now you've made it weird. So you would wait oh. on all fours <laughs> all in the dark with your top on. Uh, yeah, waiting. that's how I do it usually. <laughs> Just wait for Billy to get his shit together. <laughs> Billy's. <laughs> Billy's oh, turned it off now. All fours are on the floor. It's fine. I love I love the idea that you've never seen Billy without a <laughs> with his quarter zip on. He keeps it on while he's in the room. I love he never it. takes it off. He never takes it off. I just got him one for his birthday as well, bless him. Because I was watching your pod with Joe and George and you mentioned it and I was like, yeah, no, I should probably actually add that to my list. Well, thank you for that. Oh, it's so good. Anyway, what was I going back to? Yeah, so you guys were friends before. Yeah, we were friends before. Do we yeah. not scared shitless? Because Jamie, back in the day, mm. was a dog. Mm -hmm. A dirty dog, weren't mm -hmm. you? Yeah, you were a dirty, dirty dog. Were you nervous or no? No, not really, because I thought it was a quick in and out. Not as in that. <laughs> We're going back to the swingers party. No, we're not going back. I didn't, I didn't think it was going to be something serious. Did you really not? No. Why, why do you think it was going to be something serious? He's offended now. Look, yeah. off the wedding. I also had just come out of a relationship. <laughs> really serious. So, <laughs> <laughs> I had just come out of a relationship as well. And then we That's went, not hard though, to be fair. Yeah. That was like a revolving door. Oh my God. I was just going from... I was in a lot of different <laughs> relationships. And... Uh, and then I came out of the relationship and then I met you. I, but the weird thing was, I don't know if you've ever had this, maybe you have it with Billy. Oh no, I'm scared. You're not going to say this. What? He is. What am I about to say? Give me the clickbait. I oh. was not about to say that. <gasps> the atmosphere was electric. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I the just, sexual drive <laughs> is electric. <laughs> My God. I did say to you though. Also, why is this flea still up to the top? I slept in that the other night. It's definitely not me. I was going to have dribble all over it. What, did you really you slept in it? You were like, Sophie, wake up. You're wearing a fleece and you're boiling. <laughs> <laughs> it's like your dad. I was <laughs> dripping in sweat. I know, yeah, yeah. Go on, you need to get up. Hurry up, get up. No, when we were, when we were mates at the beginning, we were mates. And mm. then, um, I don't know what, I don't know what happened. Like, I think like when you, I, I suddenly started to fancy her in South Africa. I, I oh, suddenly well, realised. setting for Yeah, I suddenly yeah. realised I fancied you. And then I suddenly realized like suddenly. an epiphany. I actually do, I remember you you came out in like a bikini and I was like, oh my god. Oh fuck sake. Yeah, I have not the for three that. months, that's why. No, but it wasn't that, but I never <laughs> saw you as like I was like really whacking out. On it, this my is, ex had moved to Australia, so I was like, right, sure. Oh, get get my shit together. And I got I don't actually this is the truth. I haven't said this before. Honestly, right. Sophie. Sophie and I were such good friends and we were always awkward. I was always awkward around her for some reason. I was a bit like, oh, I don't, you know. Yeah, I was a bit like awkward or whatever. And then you came out, we were in South Africa, you came out in this grey bikini 
And I was suddenly like, oh my God, she's a woman. I was like, I, I just suddenly realized that you were like. You saw her tits. Yeah. <laughs> and that does happen to men when they reach Aww, puberty. I like that. And they realize. That's what it was. That you is know, sweet. It's just suddenly, sweet. To me, I take that as a compliment. Love it. Should. Yeah. Why do you take that as a compliment? Because I've been working really hard at that moment. I've been boxing. I didn't off. drink for three months. <sighs> it's all gone down the drain now. Yeah, you just came out and you were suddenly, I was like, oh my God, she's so hot. Oh, okay. Yeah. You're not right. God. But are you all, <laughs> And then I had a wank again that night. <laughs> no, he did in, in the, the middle of the loo. When I, we were sharing was the a bed, oh. and he kept going to the loo in the middle of the night and having. Oh wank. my god! No, that is not spilling all the raw in the morning multiple <laughs> times. That's crazy. <laughs> red raw. <laughs> I can't. Anyway. Uh, <laughs> Oh my god! Well, I'm glad you're together now. Yeah, it's working Honestly, out. It's like this is. <laughs> <laughs> it's like it's funny. Yeah, you're spilling everything. You're not as like revealing as this on our podcast. But, but have you no, ever, have you ever dated date. a friend of yours? God forbid, no. Because do you know why? When they get to know me, they think, "Oh no, <laughs> really? oh, Billy did no. It. no." That's because Billy was drunk at first. And then on our first <laughs> day, I no like, literally. And then on our first day, I kept getting him drunk, and I was like, "If I keep this up for a year." <laughs> It will be in too late to then go. And it actually has worked incredibly well so far. It's worked incredibly That's well. That's a great idea. Oh, I couldn't date it, mate. Because once they're my mate, I'd be a bit like... You couldn't you know do it. I mean? <laughs> yeah. And if they saw me in a bikini, they'd be like, when were you a 12-year-old boy? <laughs> when did that happen? So it just, that wouldn't have the same effect I, at all. I saw you on Pete's um, podcast where he said... Oh, no. <laughs> basically called you a pepper army with a hat or something. Yeah, no. And during my live show as well, he was like, yeah, you've just got a really long back with a slit down the middle. And I was like, how have you got this confidence now? We've met once. <laughs> we've met once. You, yeah. You were, so you got just a long back with a with slit, a slit in the middle like the little pepper army man <laughs> i was like maybe i'll just leave the show to you i thought how about that i thought he said that you had like a pepper army that has a hat on <laughs> yeah never wear hats <laughs> so that's actually not factual at all to be honest oh but my god you guys just did your live show yeah and i'm really embarrassed because i thought you actually had robbie williams on i think loads of people still think no i was that. telling everyone i was like you see they had robbie williams like, on Fuck. yeah i was like i've had fucking pete wicks got really step up that shit for the next one <laughs> really step it up yeah everyone <laughs> thought that we had robbie williams and they we did do. <laughs> yeah, but in your, my defense you put on your story going robbie williams yeah with a man singing a robbie williams song so i thought well yeah that was the point. We wanted to have Robbie Williams and so we, we got a fake Robbie Williams. <laughs> yeah. Jamie thought he would get Robbie Williams. He was like, I'll get Adele, don't worry. <laughs> I'll message him. He was like, don't worry, Lewis Capaldi, tight. <laughs> that is the my biggest mom, lie. My mum still thinks Lewis is coming to the wedding. Oh. I went to a family dinner the other night and the, the, my mum's family friend went, well, you set Amy up with Lewis. He's coming to the wedding, isn't oh, he? My. Oh, you, now you've actually got to make that happen. I'm sorry. We're having, our, obviously, our wedding of and course. like we've like teed it up because obviously we've done our podcast about it yeah. and things like that. Not we, you. <laughs> I think we both teed it up now. Anyway, we've done our podcast together and I think everyone's expecting like a big surprise at the yeah, end. Yeah. Nothing's, yeah. Ha nothing's happening. Oh. There's no surprise. Okay. The, I, there's so no surprise. Expecting like Margot Robbie coming down like on a stream. I think top. you could. If you just say multiple times every podcast episode and just put that on TikTok, someone has to come through. Has to. That? Okay, let's do it now. Who, who do Lewis you Lewis Capaldi yeah, is coming to our wedding. camera. Lewis Capaldi's coming to our wedding. No, no, hang on yeah. a second. No, you, no, you're not going to say... No, you're not saying... Someone's going to say You're that. telling him. You're telling you him. Are. Oh, um, you are. You have to so pretend this is like... Yes, pretend it's this really is like cool. A, we got Lewis Capaldi a, coming to our wedding. No. <laughs> I think you've got the wrong idea for what we're trying to do here. You need to ask boy. before you, you receive. I'm getting claustrophobic just looking at you. Be, our guests aren't going to see this and then think that look, you, you're, you have to ask. Pretend it's like a charity appeal. Mm. I don't know what you're asking me to do. Please, Lewis, can you come to our wedding? Yes. Yeah, but you have to ask him, so why? So get teared up. Oh, Lewis, I have a really <gasps> oh, lovely Lewis. group of friends and such yummy food. And the sun is out. And the it's, bar. You know, the mm. bar's there. Yeah. I'm free. there. Jamie's there. Yeah. I'm there. I hope so. Um, yeah. I hope both of you. I might be there. <laughs> yeah. Grace is gonna be there. Yeah, flower girl. <laughs> She's gonna be the ring girl. I'm singing if you don't turn up. So, <laughs> so if you could turn up. And singing your song. Yeah. And, what, and so what do you want to sing? Um Go on, sing it. What is it? I mean, they're all a bit depressing, no? <laughs> yeah, but go on, he's getting so here we go. For the first time, this is gonna be for the oh, first God. time, yeah. Mr. and Mrs. Grace, Zing. And then <laughs> No, I don't like And then he's gonna sing what? This is now. No, stop. <laughs> oh, I can't. I don't even I know what that was. No, I don't like singing. I have very bad problems with words. But what's the Lewis Capaldi <laughs> song? Well, you sing it then. I know what it is. Go on then. Uh, it, 
Stay another day. <gasps> Stay with me. I think we should end the pod. It's been great having you We're on. We're done. I mean, a really good episode. Honestly, someone's fighting. <laughs> but, but I think what the problem is is that people think it's like a big thing's going to happen, right? Yeah, because you, your, your fucking podcast is called Nearly Weds. You have bigged this up. We've really bigged it up. For Christ's sake. We've really big, and nothing's going to happen. And so at the end of our life. Fuck's sake, so we're putting it down like this all up. At the end of our oh, live no show, friends, they'll all be like, "Fuck, we're not coming now." <laughs> at the end of our live show, we, Sophie and I were like, "We need to end it with something quite cool and exciting." Yeah, of course. So we were like, "Well, let's get a fake Robbie Williams, right, to come on," which is was fine. fine. Anyway, I I got on with so Sophie and I were stage. We we're saying goodbyes, and I said, "Listen, I can't believe I, I believe I'm saying this for one night and one night only. Yeah. Please, I can't believe I'm saying. This. Please, <laughs> welcome to the stage, Mister Robbie Williams." The crowd goes wild. D- went wild. Two girls in the front like started crying. They were like so excited the whole thing, and then Robbie comes out like this, and it was let me entertain you, Spot and on. he comes out and goes. <laughs> and I had, go, I had to go. No, Robbie, Robbie, your mic's off. Your mic's off. What? And that's when everyone realised it wasn't. What Robbie makes Williams. it even better was my mic wasn't off, and so all you heard was me go, "Let me." <laughs> And then going, going like, the oh my god, look, his wife's on stage. The whole thing was just oh. me, mic on. And then Sophie, Sophie walked off stage, and she didn't realise her mic was on. Went, that was cringe. <laughs> yeah, everyone had it. <laughs> Perfect. That's why someone needs to be controlling that mic. Yeah. Did you shit yourself a bit though doing a show? Because it is a bit scary. I really didn't, but you kind of did. Did but you? I, I think I looked like I shot myself because everyone came up afterwards and was like, you were nervous, weren't you? But Jamie <gasps> helped you out. I was like, I'd be like, you're uninvited to the fucking <laughs> wedding. How about that? It Speaking was, like that. It was, but you found it nerve wracking, right? For your live show. Yeah, no, I don't remember any of it. I was blackout. You've got to, <gasps> you, but you, Are you fucking joking me? If you think I was getting up there sober, God is so. it just you who does it on your own? Yeah, and that's why it's even worse. Fuck, I've yeah. I've got to hold that thought. Oh. That's, that's full on. Yeah, I know. It's awful. And I'm just sat there like, and you know, sometimes the alcohol wears off a little bit halfway <laughs> through and you're like, oh, I am doing this now. And I've got about 40 minutes left. <laughs> so I've really got to pull this out my ass. It's terrifying. Does Billy make an appearance? No, but he was backstage the whole time. He was running around like a headless chicken, bless his soul. Oh. And do you know what? A lot of people wanted to fuck him. At the shows too. And I thought, you wouldn't get this on Nearly Words, would you? You wouldn't get someone trying to mount you, would you? Well, they might have done, I, don't I know. Honestly, for this whole time, still can't get the image of you on your all, Same. on all fours. <laughs> I think you go with a belt. <laughs> Billy, yeah. it's time. When did the belt come uh, in? Yeah, you yeah. just made that up in your weird fantasy there. Why is there a belt with a bell on it? Yeah, have <laughs> real imagery going on. <laughs> I might try this now. Do you ever do role play together? No. Really? Do you do role play? No, but sometimes I'd like to think that um, like when we're like six <laughs> years in, I'll be, I'll, we'll be out. Uh, that was me out dancing. What are you doing? Are you walking out dancing? I'm dancing. This is me. Well, you're walking out of a room? No, I'm, no, just, she's in, I'm the in the room. Oh, Listen. wait. So you're by yourself in the room? Yeah. Why are oh, you wait, doing that? You so I'm still? dancing. You look Stop like you're holding, holding like plates on your head. Okay. Move the head. It's freaking me out. Whoa. Oh, oh, there we go. Okay. okay. Robbie Williams is in. And then I see Bill from the other side just gone to get me a drink, bless him. Uh, and I go, hey, what's your name? And then we pretend we don't know each other. Oh, you're doing like a stranger one. And then I think that could like, once six years in, could spice things up a bit. We should try it now. Let's pretend I'm Billy. Okay, okay. here we go. Okay. 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 <laughs> yeah. RJ, can you leave? Yeah. Is that all yeah, yeah, yeah. You're the DJ on the decks, go. Okay, okay. Let's just watch. All right. Oh, hey. Hello, you all right? Yeah, not too bad. What's your name? Uh... Barry. Wow, love mm. the fleas. Thanks very much. A little bit hot in here, but that's all right. But it is. Take it off. <laughs> um, I, <laughs> <laughs> is that appropriate? <laughs> I'd say I'll talk to someone in the club. I can't hear you. I'll probably be going, what? <laughs> Speak louder. What was also, that? <laughs> why am I wearing a... You look like Jamie Red- Lang. <laughs> <laughs> Also, what I love about it, the whole scenario was yeah. different. You were dancing like that. However, I still have to be wearing the fleece. Yeah, <laughs> I don't know why I brought that in. Some people do, you know, like the Canada goose jackets, and they're like, yeah. yeah that's... Cap on them like beanie on Yeah, and I think you're selling drugs, probably. <laughs> There's no need for you to be wearing that jacket. I remember I went there. to a 16th party once. Why? Well, what the <laughs> hell? Yeah, the other day. It's on the register. <laughs> Bless you. Yeah. I went to a 16th party when I was younger. Why? So I got my hay for this kicking in. I went to a um, I went to a 16th party when I was 16, 
and I decided to go as like a, as a bin man. No, that makes sense. What? <laughs> a, what? No, like like a trash can. I went as a trash can. Was it fancy dress? It was fancy. Yeah. You should have specified that before. <laughs> it was fancy, and I wore a bin liner. <laughs> I didn't even <laughs> yeah. wore one. You can't. No. no. <laughs> Funnily enough, yeah. well, I was boiling. <laughs> <laughs> to cook it up you look boiling now like, can, we, can we take the fleece off someone give him a fan if I take my fleece off my head comes off oh you meant to laugh that, that, that was such a dad trick that's why I was laughing ha 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 come on let's unzip it honey right. that little red face Ooh. you can take this off oh my oh, god don't get hit it the mic because we can't be doing oh, that god. again okay. squatting right. in serious oh my god oh, right, he's yeah. like a new man imagine I was wearing a quarter zip <laughs> I'd be like, why is it like, you know, the, the dolls where you keep undoing it? And there's another what, one outside. What, the Russian dolls? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I just keep getting smaller and smaller and I'm smaller. Like, why is there more clothes on underneath? I just keep getting smaller and smaller and smaller. <laughs> smaller. It's not hard to do. Until I disappear. Oh, bless his soul. Okay, <laughs> you guys live together, don't you? Yeah. Unfortunately. Yeah. Is there, what itch do you guys have living together? Like, is there anything you've noticed and been like, fucking wish he'd move out now? Shitting with the door open. Oh, why did you do that? Shit particles are flying everywhere. Pop is squeezing his back as instant egg. You oh, fart in your sleep. I love that. All right, get out. <laughs> <laughs> We're still on nanny lads and there's rules. <laughs> and this isn't real alcohol, so I am fully sober right now. <laughs> Sorry. I do not fart in my sleep. I never fart. I've woken you... myself up farting before. Yeah, it's well, a do you want to know fry, something? Once I was asleep, this is wild, I'll probably cut this out. Once no, I you're was not, asleep Grace. and yeah. my... Um, Bill's room is right next to his brother's room very thin wall I'd say like plaster do you know what I mean that mm. kind of thing and um, <laughs> I was asleep and I did the loudest queef that I thought queef? yeah we just oh, but right, it, I'd fine. fallen asleep after and I did the loudest queef I thought someone was breaking into the house <laughs> And it woke me up and I was so... so you must have passed out quite quickly. My, <laughs> laying, laying on my back is actually very tiring. So, but yeah, it woke me up and I thought, fucking hell, I need to see a gynecologist because that was in the amount of air that was probably in there was crazy. Do you, every time you do it, go, it wasn't me. No, I, go, I was it like, wasn't me. It? I literally was like, who's in the house? And I was like, I know everyone in this house heard that because it shook the fucking walls. Grace thought someone was breaking it. It was Who is it? So, <laughs> who is it? Who is it? Just my vagina walls. I'm going to burst. Oh my God. <laughs> I'm actually on my house. Stop telling me I'm going to burst because I will. That was oh. me trying to make you feel better about fighting in your sleep. Oh. I, I never, but Queen What icks do we have about each other? Um, icks that Farting. I have. I really don't like it. And he lifts the bouchy and goes, like he's a dog cocking uh, his leg. I'm like, are you okay? <laughs> are you joking? The ex I have about you is that when you go to the bathroom in the middle of the night, you, you don't, I see you go and pee and you don't flush the loo. Yeah, because I'm saving Loads the planet, bitches. Loads of people fucking do that. But do you know what? And then the next day you go in there in the morning, I think, fucking hell. I know. What's happened here? But I do. And I know you don't drink very much water, so I know that smells like asparagus. <laughs> it, looks like, it looks like a Barocca has been. Yeah. <laughs> it's honestly like. Oh, no. It is. It's shocking. It's a shocking. Barocca. That's, that's what. That's I, unbelievable. <laughs> that's one of my eggs. What other. I don't really have. How many. What other eggs no, I have? No, I'm quite a clean, cap, clean person. You're very clean. Um, what do I have eggs about you that really like. Oh God! You just leave like like you leave lights on and I don't have any ex lists. Or yeah, yeah, yeah. Or Let yeah. Me, yeah. yeah. Leave lights on. You leave lights on. You leave like the fridge open sometimes. Like sometimes you, I'm hungry, I go for a wee, and then I come back and realise what I want. You, you, the amount of deliveries that come to the house is just crazy. Yeah, yeah, what can I say? Yeah, listen, hashtag gifted. What can you do? <laughs> it's crazy. You Grace, do it. It's crazy. Sorry, you didn't. Yeah. Get me. I yeah, so you don't get sent anything. I don't get anything. It, the, the amount of gifts that, or whatever these parcels arrive all the time. That's yes. a, a real annoying. Well, thing. what's your Rick? This is your time to yeah, get back at him now. Um, two very simple ones: squeezing the black hairs on the nose. It, it, to be fair to him, he's got a really clean face. Like he doesn't have a yeah, single black yeah, hair. Yeah, I see that. But he squeezes. There's nothing there, and it drives me mental. Pooing with the door open is vile, and then yeah. asking me to come into the room to watch his TikToks with Spencer whilst he's oh, shitting. That's crazy. And he won't stop. He's like, Sophie, come here. Please let me know if it's funny. How long's your shits? <laughs> oh, Grace. That's, that there's is no, a lot. There's no clock that can count them. If the <laughs> <laughs> we need a sundial and or farting. I do not, you're making me sound like I'm gross. You just, you're quite a bottom I liked guy. it when we first started dating and suddenly I kept finding a, a bin in front of the loo. And it's where Sophie- Oh, where you put your feet up. I didn't know that Why was a thing. Why did I leave it there? Do you know what though? Like, <laughs> 
does at help. the end of the day we've got good bowels <laughs> so that's yeah. actually a flex if anything because you poo better if you like that yeah all comes or out put one them way on like the seat if you <laughs> oh jesus I mean, imagine someone walking in on that though i need to sit there on my throat just going, hold on. it's all right just down the, the oh. <coughs> <coughs> don't die you got a wedding soon thank you <laughs> Okay, on to weddings. Uh, I'm glad you got the X out of the way. You guys nervous? I think you're pretty nervous. I'm quite nervous. What are you nervous for? Um, walking down the aisle. Yeah, because what if you trip? <laughs> Is he going to cough again? No, I, but I don't know why. I don't know why you're nervous about walking down the aisle. It's like the most exciting thing no, in the but world. Everyone's watching you. Gee, I don't get this, Grace. I don't mm. understand. I'd why forget that's how to walk. I and also I don't my heels. Oh yeah, I mean, you're quite small. I honestly, I think it's like Give the most stall. exciting freaking thing in the entire world. The fact that we're getting married together, we're, we're best buds. You get to, we get to walk down the aisle and like then confess our love in front of all our friends and family. That is lit. Lit. You heard it here first. Heard it here. Yeah. Well, do you not get scared? Like my big thing is kissing, you know, your man and wife oh, or whatever. No, and you kiss in front of everyone. I'd do this. I'd go like Same. That. We might have to go. How would you do it? I'm going to... Are you just gonna peck me? Yeah. I'm gonna Are you not gonna we, snog him? No, we're so, not doing it now. Yeah, come on. Let's, even... let's do a little. Yeah, I'll, I'll be the, the <laughs> person. Okay, really, yeah, here we go. Uh, yeah, Jamie and Sophie. No, no, no. Done your vows. No, go on. He's gonna uh, cough again. Done your vows. That was mm, beautiful. Um, you. I guess I should probably pronounce you man and wife. No, husband man and wife. wife. Husband, husband and wife. <laughs> just in case anyone's man, unsure. Uh, you're a wife. Woman. <laughs> oh fucking hell! I was gonna go woman and wife. Husband and wife. You may now kiss the bride. <gasps> Why was your mouth open? Why was your mouth <laughs> open? Know. That was crazy. Are you joking? <laughs> Don't, I'm glad we practiced that. Are you joking? Jesus. Do Sophie, he went in like this. Sophie, went in like I'm this. I'm scared. I'm you scared. Are you you joking? should be. They nearly you swallowed you whole. Okay. Why are you opening your mouth? Yeah, no, why are you doing that? Are you that? joking? How are you meant to kiss? How? <laughs> Oh my god, that looked like an asshole. I've forgotten how to kiss. <laughs> I've forgotten how to kiss. That was wild. <laughs> We're not doing it here. I'm not doing it with cameras. Give me a kiss. This podcast is really big, so lots give of people do it. Well, why are you giving me a kiss, then, right? <laughs> what is this? Wow. I don't like it. There's well, viewers all over the place. That we kiss on camera. <laughs> They're all joking. hidden cameras. Please, yeah, give her a kiss on the forehead. <laughs> no, because now I'm really dissecting your kiss here. Okay, yeah, he does her. Oh, wow. I'm sorry, Casey. No, no, oh, wow. you give me a kiss again. Okay, that was all right. That was I fine. Don't... Yeah, you just closed your mouth and smiled at me. Is that what's going to happen? Are you not a little bit excited about getting married to me? Oh, she's a bit nervous. Well, she's a bit what do you mean she's shaking. a bit? Why are you talking about yourself in the third I mean, person? It's quite scary. It's quite scary. Yeah. Grace, when do you see yourself getting married? Fucking hell, I don't know. When I, I've, I'm going to do it when I start ending up putting on weight. Because then I'm going to be like, <laughs> I'm not going to go to the gym, so it has to be now. <laughs> Before I get too big. Yeah, now. It has to be now. <laughs> now. Right now this could be now. next week and I'll be like, shit, the metabolism has slowed. We have to go. All missions go. But can I ask it? Because it, I think you it's might. a I think it's a thing about like all eyes on you. I don't mind that. Do you mind that? Uh, the thing is, right, is I have quite a hunched back. <laughs> and with everyone watching me, there you will don't. be a time where I go. <laughs> and I know at that point the photographer's going to press click and I will fight him. And that's just the issue. And the other issue is the first Wait, dance. So you're going to go, you're going to go, I'm just going to go, oh. You know, like a, a giraffe, <laughs> this is my natural, like if I'm sat down, I'm like this, because it's so comfortable. But the thing, like, I don't know, a wedding's a long fucking day as well. So wait, what's your natural state? My natural state. <laughs> yeah, do your natural state. Would be like this. <laughs> I would Why say genuinely. <laughs> What? You look like one I of those... bought a back brace off TikTok shop, <laughs> and my friend told me I was, she was like, "You cannot wear that shit. That's crazy." And it made my tits hang over the top of it, so it like I was milking. It was awful, awful, genuinely. What was the original question? <laughs> I had that you did you're, that. You're like... asking the question. Oh no. <laughs> And no, I'm sorry, a back brace with your tits. I'm picturing like a massive skim. <laughs> yeah, no, it wasn't. It was It was like that. And then it just had my belly out on the side there. Like some sort of fucking strung beef. It was crazy. And it didn't even work. I, know. <laughs> I like the idea that you're going to be like this the entire time. And then suddenly go, I'm a bit tired. <laughs> yeah, like a deflate into my seat. There she is. I got her. Just be natural. This is me natural. That's, yeah, but 
you I'm gonna... this as well? My neck goes forward. So if oh, I'm like standing up straight, it's still like that. Thank you. Do you know why that was? Why? I used to straighten my hair when I was younger and I didn't want it to crimp. So I'd go like this at school so it wouldn't crimp at the back. Were and you then... bullied at all at school? <laughs> was it a hard time for why you Why would you do that? So your neck grew. <laughs> You're saying your neck cut. grew in that position. So like this and then it just moulded into that. My mum used to go poke at the back. So I would oh my God. Wait, yeah, hang on. You think your whole body moulded because you were... Yeah, because yeah, like, like, every day it's just... If you get like used to that. Place, your hand would just stay like that. Would it? Yeah. Are you joking? You'd have like athlete's hands. Yeah, like yeah. athlete's hands. Are crazy. you joking? You think if you were No, my finger's wonky because I wrote with a pen all my life. Well, I mean, to, that's not a unique oh, yeah, experience. Sorry. <laughs> yeah. Your finger's Because I wrote wonky. with a quill. No, but I've got a dent in my finger from our album phone. Why am I doing that rock art? <laughs> I don't like... I've got a dent in my finger. What, because of your phone? Yeah, you've probably got one too. I didn't have one. 20 hours of scrolling on TikTok. No, yeah, yeah. don't you? Maybe how do you, just, how do you scroll? You maybe I just have a deformity. Down, I just hold my, it like really that. Really all my hands are like this. <laughs> every, morning, every morning I have to do this. <laughs> it's all coming out now. No, Thank no, you for no. the clickbait. Also, I was in all boys school. That was the others. Yeah. No, no, no. No, no, no. That's why they were so yeah, high. That was all the teachers. <laughs> I don't want to do it anymore. <laughs> That's why he never got detention, bless him. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah, first yeah. dance. Yeah. Have you practiced your first dance? No. 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 Are you going to? No. Just You're a like, two-step. Sorry, I'm You're laughing a lot. I'm like, and that mixed with hay fever. Bless him. I get confused. He's upset. Yeah, I'm really sad about it. Honestly, it's emotional thinking about it. You're going to have a lovely <laughs> dance on your own, aren't you? Shimmy, shimmy, shimmy. Maybe I'm not going to shimmy, shimmy, shimmy. I'm very excited to... I, I, yeah, we got our first dance coming up, and I think we're going to do something very like... I'm literally doing a one, two, three. Done. Bring oh, everyone else okay, in. fine. Bye -bye. I honestly, there's a thing. Okay, when we did our live show, right. right? Soph was a bit like like apprehensive about doing it. And then when we did it, she yeah. like home rummed it, knocked it out of the park. She's yeah. unbelievable. And then afterwards, she's like, oh God, that was so much fun. So you're thinking this will she's be the same She's going to have the same reaction. with the wedding. 100%. She'll... You won't, I think. Dancing's <laughs> so much. That's like doing a strictly and thinking I'll do that again. Oh, yeah, yeah. Any bastards. Yeah, no. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Especially so with right. this really good dance. <laughs> I got to the final of Strictly. I'm an amazing dancer. God, anything. Doing Strictly Come Dancing was actually the worst thing I've ever done. In really? Terms of no, that question wasn't asked, but let's go into it. Well, yeah. my mum said when she was like, you should off, do it. I was like, no, Bake Off. No, you on Strictly would be really I good. I mean, the nap. Hunchback, yeah. <laughs> doing the cha-cha. Be awful. Yeah, but, but when, it, when it's movie week. <laughs> I'd be the Hunchback. No, no, no. Not no. to dump. No, do you yeah. know what? And you could Someone's be dancing with the bell. <laughs> would I? On all fours. You can start on all fours and then the lights come up. <laughs> really? That's my go-to. Oh, I hope I stay in that. for movie week and then that's it. Oh. But some people when they do wedding dances, they do this whole choreography where they all come out and they're like, find that cringe. I find that yeah, cringe. But it, yeah, but it's cringe if, if you're, I think if you're like a proper dancer. But who's putting Uptown Funk on at a first dance? Yeah, I know. That's the weird thing. Yeah. But I've seen these ones on TikTok where this, that, that, no. this like couple come out and they're doing this together. Yeah. And you're like, oh, this is fun. Two and a half minutes in and they're still like. They're still going. And you're like, oh my God. And you can't go to the bar yeah, you're because like, it's rude. Yeah. yeah. I think that's a shout. Three seconds in, everyone up. I think I'll skip the dance. We'll just have, just have dancing or something. Maybe I, I'll do the same. No, you're with me. Like, Love how you're together. now. Well, maybe you can do your own little dance, and then you go, come on, crowd. No, honey. And you come in with the crowd. Yeah, yeah you come on. Oh, like, like that. Shimmy, shimmy, shimmy. Yeah, yeah, bringing them all in. Come yeah, on. Yeah, yeah. Like it's West Side Story. Yeah. I like it. And we can go, ah. ah. No. I want credits there. I want to be an American. No. I didn't know what, I thought you were going to sing American Idiot, and I was like, why is that on the playlist <laughs> for the wedding? So, what what would, sure white I am. <laughs> what would be your ultimate wedding song? Give it to me. Oh. Is for <laughs> no, don't Dancing to I that. I got that straight away though. <laughs> Dancing. <laughs> Dancing to that. Okay. Yeah, because then you could be like, L. or you could be like, oh, L. It's it's for the way you Because then your hands are occupied. E. All right, she's got an ass. That's why she can do that. <laughs> do, do an I'd e. be stuck on that one. I'd be like, be editing or something. Do you think you guys are gonna gonna seal the deal on your wedding night? No. Yeah, I think 100%. I think we'll be quite tired that night. No, I think... I don't think you'll get it up. I, the amount of drink, oh, I don't know if you will. He's quite Actually, a nightmare in the morning. Oh. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> don't come in yet. <laughs> no. It's like Wolverine. 
<laughs> He's been summoned. <laughs> <No>, I'm ready. <laughs> <laughs> um, um, I think we definitely will because we're going to have sex on our wedding day are you kidding me my thing is right I think it's overrated some people wait eight weeks before their wedding oh, day to we be wait eight weeks it. all the time <laughs> wait wait so, that's yeah. how you know you're ready to get married wait that's so hang you on know. you wait eight weeks yes yeah, so and then you're all your, your balls are full for the wedding night but the thing is I'd say that's maybe like cool. after you've said yeah you I don't know what you do, maybe like sign papers or something. And then you just quickly go in a room, quickly get it out, and mm. then you can go and enjoy your night. Because you know? <laughs> then you don't very, have, that's very Because then you can get very yeah. drunk. Are you joking? That's very me. Do you, do you know what they used to do like back in like um, in Tudor times? I think when the king and queen got Something, married, yeah. everyone used to watch them. Um, oh. Yeah. Like in a room, they would have like the yeah, bed and people would have like a gallery a around. Yeah. We should create a gallery that's around that's and everyone would yeah. just stand and watch us. That put me off, I think. Once again, top on, lights off. We're going to have to read it braille for what's happening in that room. Braille. I would have strobe lighting. Yeah. So it'd just be the occasional shot. <laughs> so if you go, get on. Me just going, going, stop. Me just going, stop. Me just... stop. But you know what? Does it make you feel a bit weird that, you know, on wedding days, mm. everyone's like, they're shagging tonight. Everyone knows you're going to shag on your wedding day. night. That was last night. Oh. I fell asleep. I, I, baby, we're going to have sex on our wedding Are we going to have real passionate sex? We are, are we going to? Be? I feel like your child. I feel a bit sick. No, I feel a bit sick too. Like this is a... Yeah, oh, this is a podcast. I keep forgetting. Mm. Well, I think that, look, we had friends who have scheduled in time to have sex. Oh, oh really? No. Yeah. They have they lists, it. I reckon. Yeah. No, we did. Who? We're not going to say their names, but we know them. That's weird. No. They scheduled <laughs> in the time to have sex. Isn't that weird? Yeah, quite weird. I don't know. I think really... Grace is going for the drink. Oh, that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Give Grace, me a minute. Well, I don't know. I think that I think that getting getting married is like there is a lot going on. Also, it's like a really weird, like strange thing. You have all of your friends and family there. Yeah, it's like intense. Mm. You have to walk down the aisle. You have to do a dance. You have to do speeches. You have that to stand happens, up and yeah. say all these different things. Like everything is like really hectic and all that kind of stuff. At the end of the night, I actually just think you're knackered. Yeah, I, think... I agree. Thank God you're saying that. Yeah, I just think you're knackered at the end of the night. And was there like, any beef when you guys chose your like bridesmaids? What is it? Is it a, a groomsman? Mm. A man? Mm. What did you have, Sophie? I was me sailing, but you, on the other hand, have chosen 14. I have a lot of groomsmen. Got enough I've, suits for that. Probably <laughs> sold out a fucking shop. Mm -hmm, a lot of suits. Oh, but we've got also, we're doing black tie. Of course you are. I love that. <laughs> yeah, we're doing black tie. <laughs> They're all relevant, is that? Well, I don't know. It's quite a nice thing He's to do. painting Just the scene. Just so you know. Yeah, so, uh, it's, <laughs> it's about storytelling. I'm painting the scene. So we got black tie mm. and I've got groomsmen and I have three best men. and Or well, two best men, one best woman. Not actually at all. Mm -hmm. And that was pretty tricky. There was no drama involved in that, really. You just had to include everyone. Yeah, but it's hard, though. Yeah. Yeah, it's hard. Yeah, I'd just be like, if you want to do it, do it. <laughs> yeah. No one would step forward. <laughs> I'd be like, I'll have the cat do it then. <laughs> That's the case. My mum probably wouldn't even be asked. She'd be like, when's this over then? You'd boxes. have your cat be yeah. your bridesmaid. And like, you know, the ring and bearer. A little, a little drag. Yeah, you'd probably shit on the middle of the flight. How do you do it? It's tricky though. And it's like kind of like a political thing as well when you're asking. Yeah, all... it's tough. It is tough, isn't yeah. it? Because I think, I think everyone has some problems when they do it because you feel... Also, when you invite people to weddings, like that's quite tough because. Oh, well, Jamie's invited everyone. Yeah, I've invited everyone. Botox, um, Botox doctor, therapist, everyone. The <laughs> therapist needs to make notes on that night on what she to She said, unpack. no, no, I can't come. Oh, this really? Is inappropriate. Yeah, we asked wow. the therapist and she said it's inappropriate. Not we, I? you. That's yeah. hilarious. I asked her and she oh, said. So you, you're having like quite a big wedding then? Yeah. Fair. We got like 200 people coming. Yeah, I'd be, yeah, fair. I'd put the invite on TikTok. But we, do you know, our friend put the invite up on social media. Why, sh why do they do that? I don't know. And then now we've got people RSVPing <gasps> who aren't even invited to the wedding. Well, what do you do then? You can't go, sorry. Got a bouncer. Yeah. It's so <laughs> we've got a bouncer coming. But also, it's also weird because we, we don't, because we have loads of like extended family and things like that. So we're freaking out as well. Yeah. That we, that the people who have RSVP'd who we don't know are potentially friends yeah, but or like, boyfriends. Do we know them or don't Do you know we? what you need to do? You need to be like, guys... Uh, just email this if you want to come and then you'll have all the emails That's good, and yeah. then you can work through it and be like sorry you emailed too late we're now full it's it's That's honestly exciting. it's honestly the biggest headache getting married is so much are you good at admin 
No. Yeah. It's, it took me a minute to clock what you meant. <laughs> so that's how good I am at that. <laughs> no. You did. The, the... You looked away like in a distant way and then came <laughs> back. So you're like, admin? No, I don't know what I that is. I don't even make lists. But you know what I mean? So it's, 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 an, it's, it's a, a lot. Yeah, it's a lot. I don't bet. do it. Oh, well, this is what I was going to move on to. Mm -hmm. You've had your stag. Yeah. Someone got lost in the snow. Yeah. Nearly died. Oh, damn Someone was like, it's not funny though, is it? They could have died. And I was like, I found that quite funny. <laughs> it was actually the funniest thing. Funny. Funny. But have you had your hen yet? No, it's the weekend after our English wedding. <gasps> what? I know. That's a Ooh. bad luck though, is it? Paris. Paris. Oh. Am I meant to know? We? We. It's all I've got up my sleeve. I love that. Your, your Paris wedding is going to be... Wedding? I'm getting married <laughs> to a Frenchman out there. <laughs> Can't. Your With Paris wedding knows. is going to be... Yeah, what? <laughs> Your Paris Jesus. hand. Yeah, sorry. I'm, oh, sorry. We'll get there. We'll get there. <laughs> Can't get over it. Um, your Paris hen is going to be great, I think. You get a stripper. Oh, I don't know. I don't know anything. Oh, so someone else planned it for you? Yeah, my sister, my maid of honor, has planned it oh. also. I mean, she, she's told me outfits, and I'm just skadoodling there. And then I'm like, oh, Would you want a stripper? I think it'd be Yeah, get funny. one last cop. Well, I mean, I've had magic mind. Not to have that cup. Sorry. I just... Yeah, and I'll just clap. <laughs> Yeah. I'll just send you a photo. Yeah. Are you doing what? You like, <laughs> like this. <laughs> the next morning I'll come home and yeah. Ah. <laughs> yeah, I'll know. Let me see your hands. Sorry. Let me see your hands. <laughs> no. <laughs> Let me see your hands. <laughs> you went, you, I think you would, you, have you ever had a stripper before? No, of course I haven't. Really? You've never had a stripper? Ooh, Magic Mike the other night. No, but I haven't. Have you? You acted surprised. Once at my uh, management's Christmas do, and he had a plastic cock and he, he made it accidentally fall out. <laughs> and I was like, that's crazy. He had a, he had a what? But Billy was like, what the fuck? And I was like, I just want to say, it was plastic. <laughs> Before anything happens here. Wait, so it's all He was dressed as Santa. This Wait. man came in with a big old sack. And he came in and then, well, well, well. You know that song came No, on. what was that song? No. Wait. Wait. What, what is that song? Kind well, 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 <laughs> well. You know what I mean? No, do Okay, you if you're Orny, ride to it. That's no, ride it, pony. So. So how does it go? What, I'm not doing it again. No, no, so I'm Santa, walk in. Okay. Well. Wait, well, 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 well. Take off the sack. Well, yeah. well, well. And then he strips off his oh. little Santa thing, gets people on the chair, and he, bless him, he was so consensual. Before he, he'd do anything, he goes, you okay with this? <laughs> and I thought, it's the thing is, it's you've ruined the moment there by going, can I whip my plastic off? Yeah. And then does it. But it was a really And he had experience. a plastic penis? Yeah. And then he did this, right? When he took it off and then he had it little like dangling there. Oh my God. <laughs> and then we were it's like, not... oh my God, cock alert. And then it actually was just plastic. <laughs> it's not plastic. It, no, that was a plastic cock. I've seen Where's that. his that was actual cock? That real tiny toddler. probably tucked in between the cheeks. I don't know how big it is. <laughs> Why was he using a plastic one? I don't know. And do you know what? He had a great time. <laughs> he was consensual. <laughs> I love the idea. Well, 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 well. Are you okay with this? <laughs> Imagine if he went, no, he'd be like, <laughs> I know. Well, 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 well. Rewind the track. Thank you. <laughs> but no, I think uh, stripper, but then stag do scare me. Mm. Mm. They're know. a little bit scary. They're intimidating. Yeah. Right? No, for Sophie, I'm not talking about you. Well, my stag day was all right because like, we were like skiing and it was over four days. And you, know, you don't take your clothes off really when you're skiing. Oh, he no. did. We uh, got naked. For I didn't get really. naked at all. That I got time. a photo of you stood next to a guy like this with your top off. Really? <laughs> yeah, good that you remember that. I didn't remember that. <laughs> what else do you remember? I didn't even remember that. Yeah. No, I think we had a friend who nearly died because uh, he was walking. The we have a, one of my other friends who came in the stag day because we drank a lot. He's now gone to a silent retreat for two weeks. Stop it. Yeah, he's gone to a silent retreat. That's worrying. Yeah, That's how you know it was a tough. It was yeah. he it was just a heavy it's drinking. The altitude, though, we went to the same place that you did. You know the place with the massive bottles of whatever the fuck. Folly, it is. the folly douche. Folly, right? That's it, folly douche, whatever. And then um, the altitude makes you feel so much more drunk. You know these sick fucks were skiing down the hill, blackout drunk. Yeah, these. Oh, so that was. That yeah. was not me. No, that was not. No, me. yeah, that's not really ski. not allowed. That that's is actually sketchy. Yeah. Yeah. No, I thought who did the risk assessment for that? But it it makes you feel more drunk up there. And also, the, people say the hangovers are fine the next day. The hangovers are That's not good. That's such a lie. It's a Never complete lie. Never heard lie in my life. That the hangovers are the worst thing in the world yeah. when you're that high. <laughs> I, I honestly went to breakfast one morning on the second day, and I was like looking. I was booking flights home. I was like, I've got a meeting. <laughs> I I've have got to go. I, yeah. I, yeah. 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 I've got. Uh, I've got a meeting. I've got to get to. Oh God, I forgot. And I it's a... when you go outside and it's cold, and you just think, should have done Bahamas. <laughs> 
Oh, should have just done a night should've in London. Should have done Tenerife. Should have done a should've night in London. Done a spa night. Yeah, no, seriously. Well, that's over and done with now. You don't have to worry about this now. I've got uh, a surprise for your hair. I'm excited. Have you? Mm -hmm. Oh, oh my god! I've it's him stripping with a plastic. Car. Yeah. What yeah. is yeah. that? Wow! 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 You okay with this? <laughs> wow! 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 <laughs> but I said I'm a cock. I just have a plastic vagina. <laughs> The marriage would be off. <laughs> Straight away, I'm like, I've got oh, to rethink wow, some things. Wow, moving off and gone under. No, I'm <laughs> pleased for the rest of the week. You know, my back wow, brace on. Wow, wow, I got Grayson's back brace. <laughs> Told you it was a surprise. <laughs> no, you couldn't have guessed that, to be fair. I <laughs> Stop it. Sorry, this is so good. Well, I want to do wow. Mr. and Mrs. with you both. Okay, let's do it. Yeah. Oh, God, hold on. Question one. Oh, wait, so... Purple, purple, Sophie. And, and I'm orange. You're orange. But first, who carries the podcast more? Ooh. Ooh. I don't know. I think you do. Oh, look at us being humble. No, I'm not even being I humble. I think the one where you cried, you carried that one. Oh, that yeah. was the yeah. best yeah. episode I've ever watched in my life. It's but unbelievable. It was so good. <laughs> unbelievable. You shat your pants. Oh, like, so my he, God. For a second. I, I, like she started crying and she was like, I'm out. And I was like, oh my God, she's actually. All the like, stuff I like, got cut as well. You should have had me. I was like, you are dead to me. Yeah, there was no. All the producers sat there like, I got all texts from them. They were like, we really don't like yeah, upsetting you. Because I was like, oh. you all fucked me over. <laughs> <laughs> and it was just about a drunken text she'd sent me. And I was like, oh my God, this has gone. Weird. She was really hung over. That's hung incredible. Over and it's the way you just came back, like, anyway. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. And she went, oh, I've just overreacted here, but it's all right. And I was like, oh my God. How are you meant to move on from that? Yeah, but so but, oh, actually, I'm going to save you because without Sophie, honestly, yeah. her. Well, there would be no podcast. <laughs> it's just the no, Jamie show. But, but, but you are so funny. Okay, shh. Right, next right, one. Okay. Yeah. Whose podcast do you think is better, yours or yours? Mine. Wednesdays. Or, or private parts. I think mine's better. Nah, oh, really? me and Melissa got a better bond than you, Matt. You think so? <laughs> All right, okay, give it to you. All right. Okay, who wears the trousers in the relationship? I actually wear them. Yeah. I think you, I mean, from what I've seen today, Jamie. She's the boss. I do think you You're do. You're the boss. It's I, me to a limit and then it's you who scoops in when the times get tough. Yeah, so, so <laughs> honestly, like uh, Sophie like steers the ship, but when right. the ship's about to hit the rocks, yeah. I'm the straight in you there. You do all of the, Yeah. Yeah. I don't know what I was going to say. Well, the shimmy. The shimmy. I, yeah. I, I do all of that. Like, I, yeah. Sophie. Okay. You... All right, there we go again. <laughs> yeah, just shut Who's down. horniest? Oh my God. Oh my yeah, me. Yeah, okay. Oh, you know Unbelievable. What, yeah. Like, honestly. Oh, sorry, what was it? What was it? <laughs> Unbelievable. So, like, I, I remember the time, do you know, we were, oh, I, no. I, I've said this story in the other podcast, we were walking in Mexico once and we were walking down the street and I was like, it's made in Chelsea big out here because everyone's looking at us. I was like, this is unbelievable. Anyway, I was like, Sophie, can you see? And she went, yeah, I know. Look down and Sophie's tip was out. <laughs> <laughs> and Sophie was like, oh my God, without putting back in. I was like, why is everyone staring at us? <laughs> Hold me with back. your back. Yeah, 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 yeah. With my back brace on. Yeah. <laughs> Tits over the top. Yeah. And, it was like, and, and she was like, oh my God, brilliant. And I was like, Oh, quite horny. Like honestly, oh. I can. Okay, next question. Yeah, but I can. Yeah, I, I was like, oh, are you sexually driven? <laughs> I, I, I am, am right now. I've got something in my head. Uh -oh, what's happened? She's having that reaction to Ryla. <laughs> yeah, I'm just so upset. Okay. What about some trauma? Um, who's the loudest in bed? <laughs> We're both pretty silent. Yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. Just waiting for it to be over. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Ready? Done. <laughs> Got five more minutes left. Yeah, mate. Five on the wish, clock. You wish. Five more minutes. Uh, Thirty seconds. Who is louder? Come on. I gave you. Yeah, probably me. Okay, fine. Who farts the loudest? Yeah. Who throws the most tantrums? Oh my <laughs> god. <laughs> Lisa, who knew? Look at me. Uh, yeah, you only Are you accountable for my actions. I oh, actually, yeah. yeah. As you Do you throw tantrums in your relationship? Yeah, only when I'm hungry. I just such a fucking hungry, lie. Yeah. yeah, when I'm hungry, I'm horrible. Same. Mm. Same. I'm like fucking foul. Yeah, hundred yeah, percent. Like, evil comes out. Or like, now. if something's not Billy's fault, I'll still find a way to, to make it. Like the train will be packed, and I'll be like, you "Fucking had to make us catch this one." You <laughs> fucking idiot. Yeah, do, do you know you do that though? He, no, a hundred percent. Yeah, and I know I'm doing. As it. I'm doing, I'm like, you psychic. And he bitch. makes such good points. He's like, "Was that my fault?" And I'm sat there going, "No," but outside, I'm like, "Yeah, it fucking was." Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why does that happen? No, no, no. Being a woman. I need not... to blame someone else. It's not me, even though it's probably all my fault. 
Yeah, thank God you guys realise it sometimes. You okay. know what? Sometimes it happens. Okay. Um, okay. Who? Well, that kind of never mind. If you had a baby, who would be more likely to change nappies? Me. Yeah, mm. you, I don't think I'd be good at changing it. No, you'd mm. like to start eating. We'll just leave it. We'll just leave it. <laughs> we'll do that later. <laughs> <laughs> Man's all cramped up. Yeah. 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 We'll just leave that. He'll be all right. We'll leave, leave it. <laughs> Later. Who, uh, oh, sorry, that was a weird one. Mm. Who's punching the most? Oh, come on. Oh, oh, shut up. Get out of here. Be honest. Yeah, that's me honest. Okay, all right. Who'd rinse the other one most if you got a divorce? He would, little bitch. Uh, you think I would rinse this? I think I would do silent. No. I, I think if we got take divorced, me to the ground. No, take, well, me, to well, the take, court. take me to the ground. I, mean, I think, honestly, if, if we got divorced, I'd just silent. Done. Really? Yeah, I yeah, think, that's so. I think I'd be brutal. Yeah, I would just you're waiting for the text. <laughs> yeah, I'd be out. I would do that thing which like Olivia Wilde got from her ex-husband where he served her on stage. Did you see that? No. He got what? a divorce. He got a divorce with Olivia Wilde's ex husband got a divorce when she was giving a presentation on stage. No, and, you no. know, you got served. That's game and gave crazy. papers that's on stage. Mad. I think that's divorce not papers on stage. You'd uh, see me the next day in jail. <laughs> <laughs> in jail. That's crazy. Yeah, that was crazy. That was oh. crazy. Who's your celebrity crush? <sighs> Pre knowing they were a bad person, Johnny Depp. Or oh, me too. Because he has that kind of like Pirates of the Caribbean. Yeah, like I'd only date him as a pirate. Same. <laughs> that yeah. black eyeliner. Hello. Love it. And he was like slurring his words. I don't know. I just find this something intriguing. So you, so, you, so you like Jack Sparrow? Yeah. I, I, yeah, Jack Sparrow. Don't really have any others. Oh, weird one. Um, Ross Kemp. Because <laughs> I could hear him being like, oh, yeah. <laughs> and that's the only reason. Do you remember when he sniffed spice in prison? And that for me was, I was absolutely, I've never looked back from that. When he sniffed spice in prison. Do you remember that when he went, oh, Grace, I'm not going to, like, that I'm is, not going to be with you on that one. That is well. the greatest. <laughs> when he sniffed spice in prison, I just never looked back. And, and there was that thing, look at me knowing everything about him. But there was that bit where he was, I don't know where he was somewhere. And the guy who had a gun, he was like, fucking shoot me. <laughs> and I was like, what a fucking bloke. What a bloke. So that I remember when he grabbed it. Why are you pointing that at me? Yeah. Don't point that here. <laughs> I was in the back. Don't point that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Sorry. Yeah. I feel ill. Who's yours? Uh, who is mine? I want both of yours. I want to compare notes. Mine would be. My Johnny Depp too. I'm with you. Johnny Depp. But Jack. Oh, Sorry. I tell you who I really like. Um, uh, Kylie so Jenner. Sophia Viegra, but back, at, back in the day. Oh yeah, she's Who high end. So, so, um, my family, modern family. The uh, oh Spaniel. no, I get that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah fair. Sexy that. Fair Quite point. like Spanish. All right. Yeah. All right. Well, I'm not Spanish. Yeah, <laughs> we move. <laughs> yeah, we groove. We're not making this up. We groove. Okay. But I said the total opposite to you. That's, you that's what I was thinking. Spanish blonde. Yeah. <laughs> you know, you've got a tan. Yeah, yeah. Time. what i like to end the podcast on yeah. is i like what your both of your advice would be to save grace it could be life advice it could be oh, shagging great. advice great okay life advice what would it be <sighs> life advice uh that i would give you would be um ask for forgiveness rather than permission so i should cheat <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's <laughs> yeah. Uh, you need a yeah, 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 yeah. Wait. And if you're going, to I didn't wait. And, uh, and also, and also, <laughs> I'll be in prison tomorrow. Yeah, yeah. Actually, don't. No, that's a terrible one. That is the yeah, worst that was one. Crazy. Too late. No, I'm not going to say you that. You've seen your tooth now. What? The, my tooth. <laughs> <laughs> We've seen your tooth now. We've seen so my tooth now. Mine would be to keep being you. Wear that back brace. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, next Brit Awards, you'll see me with the back brace. <laughs> with the tits out. With the tits if out. you wore the back brace at the Brit Awards, that or would... Or nothing else. Outfit, I'd be like, nothing out, just nipple covers. <laughs> nothing down And a leaf over the purse. <laughs> you know what would be bad, though? <laughs> yeah. You wore that at the Brit Awards and that, and I'm like, I killed it. And then it was in no papers as well. <laughs> yeah, and I still would be hunched as well, somehow. Because <laughs> everyone, <laughs> everyone thought, that's actually... you be like, oh, poor her. <laughs> no, they aren't. I'd get good seats, though, maybe. <laughs> so fair. Maybe we'll sorted.
Thank you. Great okay, so be yourself and cheat. What do you wear, what do you wear on your bum? Uh, you know what suit my wrestlers wear? But I wear that in black so it kind of looks like a bum brace. Or a jock strap. I'd wear a jock strap. <laughs> <You're> a jock- <laughs> I'd wear a jock strap. And hold a cricket bat. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. With a hand like that. It's just going to be sponsored by this pod. That's what I'm going to do. Watch out next year. I might actually do it. <laughs> oh my god hey um grace i do want to say um congrats on all your success dude Thank you're you. killing it you're doing so good this podcast yeah. is amazing the way that you interview people is unreal your show everything hey big congrats to you Thank dude you. you're awesome i stole all the good words yeah. but i second it <laughs> yeah. I times went, two times two my cheeks out from laughing and thanks for having us on we Thank loved it you. you guys have been great guests it's been fucking hilarious it's been freaking great it's been 10 out of 10 can we have a kiss now well, and with that, if you've been watching, give it a like and subscribe. If you've been listening, give it a follow and a five-star review. Goodbye. Bye. Bye.